I'm here. Um, I just, I guess I'll tell you what happened today. So today, what happened? Many things. Many things happened. In fact, so many things, I'm going to have to tell you about them. Okay, so I woke up at 8.10, which was way earlier than I was expecting to wake up. I was expecting to wake up at like 9.20, because I stayed up until 2 the night before. But I woke up at 8.10, I was like, yes, I have extra time. So then I spent it very poorly. And then from 8.10 to 10.45, I was watching videos by Atrioc. So that was bad for me to do. Then I went to my campus and I actually started working on stuff. And I think, all in all, before I was completely, like, dead and had to go to class, I got two hours of work done which was looking at all the information that are in that is in this week and then that was for accounting and writing notes down and then making a quizlet and then readjusting how I was taking my notes so that's why it took so long then I have an environmental engineering assignment that I was doing in class that I didn't finish. I don't know how many other people finish. I think I might be the only one and I feel bad about it. Oh well. What are you going to do? I'm really hungry. I still have this red thing on my face. And after that class, it was straight home. So that way I could get my insurance claim done with an insurance company. So... That happened, and I didn't really know what I was doing, so I just followed what they said to do. I got a lot of money. I'm not going to say how much, because I don't want people to come and rob me, but someone just backed into me, and I was shocked at how much money I got back. I'm partially considering giving them half, you know, just because I'm a nice guy, but I'm going to give my parents half instead, because... I was thinking about this, I was like, well, I was the one who drove the car there, but then I thought, well, they're the one who told me to go there, and they were the ones who helped me on the phone, and they were the ones who did that, so I think it's more than fair, but here, here's my demand. You must meet my demand. I require four calzones from DP Doe tonight, and if you cannot meet these demands, I will not deposit the money. And I will give it all back to the person. Because I know my parents are the only people who watch these videos. But I want calzones. And half. <laughs> Bam. That's called being in power. And knowing what to do with it. I just... I probably could extort them for more. But that seems wrong. I'm just really hungry. So that's all I thought about. Listen to that. It probably doesn't sound very good to you because, you know, your ears suck and so does my microphone at picking it up. You know what? I would... Ugh. I think it's good that I'm watching so many older videos from Atrioc, right? Because I'm watching enough old videos from there to realize, oh, okay, well, that game's coming out. Okay, when's it coming out? He was talking about a game called Harry Potter. I was, like, looking it up, and I was like, oh, wow, that comes out in 10 days that's sick i can't wait to watch i can't wait to watch that man i haven't played a video game in so long do you watch them or do you like play them oh i don't think i told you i also got my tv back but you may have seen it in yesterday's video you probably did because i said it might i set this up like the same way every single time where it is i bet you saw it and that thing has sound issues already which is really fun not really. So I think that's going to do it for this video. I just have to get this calendar stuff out of the way. Okay. 1865. House passes 13th Amendment. Damn, dude. This one is really thick on the... On this thing. I mean, look at that. That's thick. All right. House passes 13th Amendment. On January 31st, 1865, the House 
of Representatives passed the 13th Amendment to the Constitution abolishing slavery in the United States. Yes! In 1864, an amendment abolishing slavery had passed the U.S. Senate, but died in the House as Democrats rallied in the name of states' rights to own slaves. President Abraham Lincoln preferred that the amendment received bipartisan support. Some Democrats indicated support for the measure, but many still resisted. The amendment passed 119 to 56, seven votes above the necessary two-thirds majority. Several states for ratification, which came in December 1865, with the passage of the amendment, the institution had, that had indelibly shaped American history was eradicated. Yay! No slavery! But Jim Crow laws, though. See, that's what sucks. You get into history and you're like, yeah, slavery was abolished. But actually, people were really racist still. And some of them still aren't. I looked at the freaking thing again. Chimpanzees and gorillas. Here, I'll read it like this. Chimpanzees and gorillas have human-like fingerprints. And so do what other non-human animals? I'm pretty sure it said koalas. Yeah, it said koalas. I knew it was K-O- Probably A something. And I was like, that's the only animal I can think of that starts with K-O-A. And that's A-O-K. -okay. Backwards. That was pretty sick. K-O-A-L-A. -A. That's A-O-K -okay with May. Koalas are A-O-K. -okay. I don't know if I'm cringe yet. I think once I get 30, once I hit 30, I'll probably be cringe. But right now, I'm just, like, a little bit weird. You know, it's not even cringe kind of weird. It might be. Oh, gosh. You know what? I don't want to make you guys cringe anymore. Outro.